a game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for any more. How could it be otherwise when two high-level sides go head-to-head -head and toe-to-toe? -to -toe? This is football out of the very top draw. Kick-off next here on EA TV. Just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's Al Nasser, and they take on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be... Ronaldo! Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. But look at the defenders. They lose their concentration, become sloppy with their marking, and as a result, they find the ball in the back of their net. Just not good enough. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Camavinga. Now Jose Lu. Teamwork and passing in evidence. And a decent delivery. Cleared away. Space afforded him. And Ronaldo prepared to fire. Really good build-up, but no end product. He's in here. And in range. And it's in beyond the goalkeeper. Real Madrid on level. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Anderson Talisca and the challenge halts them in their tracks Mane must take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming Well, here it is again. Ronaldo finds exactly the right pass behind the defenders. And what a finish from Mane. He gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. Well, frustration for the manager. Ancelotti needs to get a reaction from his players now. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Brozovic and it's a quality pass Taliska and a goal another one two in quick succession no wonder they're celebrating well here it is again and the keeper's lost his concentration here he's totally in the wrong position he'll be disappointed with that The action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Vinicius Junior. Well, using the space really well, but now can they push on? And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence.
and does well to keep it in play. Anderson Tanisca. Real chance. Still alive. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. Personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Well, as you see, it's great skill. He threatens to hit it with power. He just puts his toe underneath the ball and lifts it down the middle of the goal. It's really good technique and also a bit cheeky. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Vinicius Jr. Now with Bellingham. Might be a chance here. Vital intervention. Well, no stopping him. Aim towards Ronaldo at the back post. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Played in by Brozovic. And the danger cleared. Chouameni. Trying to open them up. Chance to finish. Oh, not an effort. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Well, no cards handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. And the spot kick is converted as calmly as you like. Well, as you can see from the replay, the keeper tries to read the penalty, but he's sent the wrong way, and it ends up looking a very easy finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Al Ghanam. It's with Anderson Tariska. Anderson Tariska. Anderson Tariska. Can they keep it out? So now a corner. Brozovic taking. Oh, that's not a good clearance. And the move breaks down. Eduardo Camavinga. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, Sadio Mane, as ever, Stuart, bringing some of his best form to the pitch. Well, his skill level to go past defenders and get shot. So the ball rolling again, and Real left with a real mountain to climb in the second half.
Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Back in action then, and Real can now entertain thoughts of perhaps pulling level. Ronaldo. He must finish! Well, he so badly wants that hat-trick, Stuart. Well, that was the chance for the hat-trick, but the way he's playing, he's surely going to get it today. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And the keeper there to deal with it. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Kamavinga. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Oh, it's unbelievable. Who saw this coming when there were three goals down? Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Well, they've had to dig in, but just look what that means to Ancelotti. Well, you don't get too many score lines like this one. 4-4. Four, four. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front! Well, as you can see, he's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a player he is. Action underway once more. A wake-up call for the Real players, maybe. Can they find a response now? David Alaba. Vinicius Jr. And the referee blows for a foul. Anderson Taliska. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Alaba with the block. Denied again. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security.
delivering it. Well, still an issue here. And this is Brozovic. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Kamavinga. Now with Bellingham. Valverde and he's made headway there it is a goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round well here it is again he goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder and his movement so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal going to be Lajami and a creative look about this this could finish it sound piece of goalkeeping Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Substitution for Real Madrid. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Now counter-attacking possibilities. That's a lovely ball. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to give it a go with time not on their side. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo threading it through. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Well, just look at this. He's so alive to the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end. This is far from over. We're going to have five minutes of stoppage time. Fran Garcia. Oh, good looking run. And a fine cross. And the header just wide of the mark. Incisive pass. The final whistle, and not to be for Real Madrid. They have to accept defeat. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Yes, Derek, they were well off their usual standards today. And with the quality that they have in their squad, I think it's fair for the fans to demand more. Too many bystanders for me, just not good enough. <laughs>